What's up guys, it's Lothia, and today we're taking a first look at Hera. Now Hera is a very interesting character in where she should be played. And as such, we're gonna share this lane <laughs> with this Medusa for a bit before we make our way into the jungle. And we're gonna talk a bit about her abilities. I wanted to actually start on level 1 because I wanted to see a damage output. Ooh, at least it wasn't me. That's nice. Uh, may not be quite the impression of, of Hera that you will get in a normal game though. This is uh, a bot game. We will play a little bit against Tizo, who is in this game. And uh, then we can see some stuff. Does it work on minions? No, it does not. Okay, cool. So what you saw with the first ability there, it, it knocks back minions and has the secondary fist damage. However, what you just saw is it does not work on jungle camps. What works in jungle camps is this double damage. So I'm going to show you as soon as the target is back up. You have the cone targeter at the front and then you have the, the fists that smash together and one part of this deals damage in a relatively uh, well, reasonable scale I would say literally just a, a tiny bit of damage all right um, and that's the, the, the cone around her and the other part deals a lot more damage so if I throw that it will deal more damage and if one fist hits it also deals less damage than if both fists hit, and if, if both fists hit, it can do a solid amount, I would say, at least. So, what we can see here is, is that very ability, and then we also have the 2 here, which I is briefly used. That's the 2, that slow projector coming at us right there, uh, which is a, a polymorph, and you can level this polymorph too. So with these ones, I would walk up to them so I can do more damage because that knocks them in place and does a little bit more damage. And the Polymorph can also be used to clear at the same time. So it's quite interesting, as you can see here. That's that's also the Polymorph. And what I want to see now, which is why we started on level 1, is how clear it is. But it's really... Even on early levels, even with this double knockback combo, it's not absolutely crazy. It's not bad by, by any stretch, but... Um, yeah. Maybe if we get another point in this. We're gonna get a point in the three before. I just wanted to show you all abilities here. The three is simply a shield. That's all it is. Unless you have Argus out, which we'll see in a bit, then it's a bit different. Her jungle camp clear is not terrible at least. Uh, much of it is down to the fact that her one really does a lot of damage on her relative shot cooldown. I'm gonna get some boots here real quick. Make things a little bit easier. Such a and some more pots. And the Polymorph is basically the same as Kanunos, it's a silent, it's a disarm. Her three, again, just a shield with a little bit of movement speed as well. I could use it here to move a little bit faster for a 15% increase. If I have Argus out, he's gonna get a steroid as well, which means he deals, uh, well, I would say a solid bit more damage through an AoE aura, kind of like a mystical male, essentially. Oh, can I get her? Yeah. But on top of that, it will also give him 50% extra movement speed, so he's gonna be a lot faster using that. That's a pretty neat combination. See, T has been farming. She's not gone back yet. But she will now, I guess. Oh, can't hit the fist. The fist uh, has a bit of delay, but even her two is a bit telegraphed, so you can. Both you can kind of, you know, see when they're coming in. And you can somewhat avoid them. The two has a very slow projectile as well. That's worth keeping in mind. And what you can also do is pull him off two people if you hit two people. That didn't work here. But what will work here is drop Argus. Will he do enough damage? Oh, he does aggro's really... What? Okay. <laughs> Early game Argus apparently does not tank as much damage as I thought he could. He just got taken apart by two tower shots, yeah, it seems, unless that was a glitch. Um, well, good to know you, Argus. Oops. <laughs> okay, Medusa. Uh, <laughs> I was really not expecting Argus to die right away. It's ba What's his base HP here? It doesn't tell us. So here, you see the enemy Argus, he has to slow on us first. 
And um, that's on the second hit. Oh yeah, Tower's, tower's really taking him apart, huh? And uh, after that... There's also a third line hit with an extended range. So that's worth keeping in mind. A bit scared here. Kidding, I'm not actually scared. An enemy has been slain. Oh, pull him off it. Alright, now we can see how much work Argus can do on his own. <laughs> well, apparently he can do a lot of running and not actually catching up to the enemy. That's lovely. Oh boy. Um. Well, Argus strike here, I guess. Strike this. I, I don't know. Wow, he's even, ta he's even taken a lot of damage from... From like a camp, like, yeah, well, let's send him on a camp here. Like, even a small jungle camp solos him. Wow. Expect the unexpected. I mean, I guess he's a bit tankier than Calder, but... Such a beautiful gift. Oof. I, I think... Like, I, I, you know, I don't really want to speak from the perspective of, you know, not having actual players and all, but I think Argus may need some tankiness. Like, we don't really know anything about the space stats here. It's not as damage, but it seems very... Well... Your middle tower is under attack. Can I hit both? Yes. Poggers. Argus 1v1. Alright. I uh, got 19 seconds of cooldown. And the cooldown gets lowered. See, this is a nice knockback that you can see. Uh, which gets lowered for every guard you hit. 10 seconds cooldown. And I can show you some voice lines in the meantime. I only dirty my hands against truly powerful threats. Argus will be enough to handle you. You stand against Olympus? I underestimate Get out of how here. foolish gods can be. Let us transform. All right, let's let's, let's drop some Argus. A cow, perhaps? An enemy has been slain. And let's see how they do. Oh. <laughs> well, one Argus is gonna lose for sure because they <laughs> decided to. <laughs> ah. Hey, he doesn't even come. I'm trying to cancel it. No, there you go. No, <laughs> he doesn't even want to come to me. You don't, like, I, as far as I am aware, like, using the ability in front of you should cancel it. Maybe you have to target the same ability, like, the same enemy again for it to cancel. That might be the issue here. No, we're gonna get uh, damage buff here instead. I, I gotta be honest, I'm really not sure. I think Terra will need some... Some tweaks here and there. Alright, this is the shield. Rank 1 at level 8. Takes like two shots. Ooh, hello. Oh, that's the long range polymorph right there. An enemy has been slain. She's using a shield as well. You can see that. Haha. <laughs> But uh, still, the Argus does not really tank the tower, considering he's supposed to be more of a tanky god. Ooh, I killed the enemy Argus, but not the enemy Hera. Alright. He seems like... He seems like he puts out more damage than he tanks. Well, I guess we'll have to, like... We're gonna farm up a little bit. Just, uh... Maybe get him to, like, a higher rank and see how much tankier he becomes throughout. It, it feels rather weird. <laughs> yeah. Hit him? Nope. It's the extra movement speed. It's not terrible, actually. Jeffrey, I'm yeah, it's enough to catch up here. <laughs> Looks pretty cool as the as he harpy here. I could uh, I could drop Argus on him here. Might Dude, not have to. No. The knockback playing. mechanic here is pretty pretty fun. I gotta Your say, it, it looks pretty cool. 
We're on a pretty high level of CDR now. That's why I started uh, Mage's Blessing as well. I just want to get really high CDR really early. Um, can kind of finish. I think she will want the like, extra damage from other stuff. So having a soul gem here is, is definitely, oops, not the ability I wanted to use. Uh, not a bad option. That way you can really, nope, I talk. you can really get those uh, those 30% CDR right at the start, and then you get your soul gem for 40, and you get that extra damage on your abilities. Because otherwise, again, your damage isn't the highest. You see the scaling here. The scaling is is okay for the power I have, but it's not like. Insane. An enemy has been slain. You gotta get pretty ahead to be scary, I guess. And and especially Argus. I think Argus is for me the weird spot. I think I really have to play with that shield with Argus for now. And see how that works. It's your job not to die. Let's see. Let's see if we can pick a fight and see if we can get something out of this field. And again, if you if you're getting close to a camp, you should always uh, do it like with a double slap, so you get a little bit of extra damage. So, especially if you would actually like play her jungle, if you were going to do that. Do that. Uh, by the way, I just realized I put a point in the ultimate. It doesn't actually make sense, I think, because his health. How does it scale? It doesn't tell us. It doesn't actually tell us here if his health scales with level or with anything else. That would be good to know. Mm. Yeah, jungle clear wouldn't be the worst. Higher levels at least. Mm, that works. It's a bit of delay on that. Okay, I want to see the AoE effect here. Oh, the AoE effect. Oh, that's nice. That is nice. I think that's how you really want to use him. Uh, so I'm still not sure if I should put more points here. We're gonna we're gonna have him like walk around with us a little bit. Might as well put some points on after. Can I can I send him anywhere? No, he's just gonna guard me basically. So I can't just tell him to go to point X unless it's my a minion. It's so, it's so annoying to unmark targets. I'm really not sure why that is the way it is. But you can see here now like it's 48 second cooldown uh, and if I was to fight guards now I could lower it more once again. That's pretty neat. Gonna go down to the 42 seconds soon. Oh, turns around right away. Okay. This is gonna be interesting. Because, uh. Yep. I was gonna say. It's gonna be an Argus here. Poggers. Dude, that guy oh no, I got silenced. Argus, strike now. Let's get the AoE effect. Let's get this. Let's get this. Ooh, that's all we got. Now Argus needs to do the work. If he doesn't, then I'm done. My Argus lost my HP, so we just 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 going home. At this point, it may just be better to kill him off because that would reset the cooldown. But well, I don't really know if that if that works. Let's see. Send him into this guy. Yeah, it's actually okay. It's actually <laughs> yeah. not a terrible idea to do that. You just uh, get your cooldown back. You can just kill him earlier Such than necessary. Gift. <laughs> oh, okay, there's apparently a glitch where Argus is visible on the map. That should definitely not be the case. So he's revealed in the jungle still. Oh, his health bar. <laughs> um, oh yeah, as soon as we we have everything of cooldown, I'm just quickly gonna show off all abilities in order. Your job not you to stand die. against Olympus? Oh. Gods can be. Dude, that yes, guy is literally very a bot. Good. Amazing. Argus has eyes on the back of his head, and shoulders, and chest. Your middle tower Pretty much everywhere. Zeus and I lived happily for a millennium. Then we met. 
This is like the thing. As soon as you use this combo, you have to burn Argus or, or, or you're done for. <laughs> you have nothing else. <laughs> Oh, nope. didn't get the delay right here. Yeah. Uh, can't even reach him with that. Like, if somebody's running from you, it's so hard to actually get anything off but the two. And if they juke a little bit while doing it, good luck with that. So, quick show off of all abilities. Ability number one. This would knock back minions. We've already shown that. Ability number two. Ability number three. Uh, we'll show that with the ult, it's just a shield otherwise. The ult is dropping Argus down. Argus dealing damage. Argus. See, I unmarked this target, but he doesn't stop. Now he stops. Oh, and, and she still sets her off. And Argus with AoE damaging aura. That's all there is. And she's getting a little bit movement speed and he's getting more movement speed from it. So, yeah. Now you know, that's that's the stuff. Is it really worth it? I don't know. I think she will need something. Oh. Maybe maybe what she will need is more CC, actually. Here you can see the damaging aura again. Obviously, you need to, to predict a little bit where the enemies are walking, that it becomes much easier. But still, it's just... I'm just not sure if it's, it's what we need here. Could have chased him down there, obviously. Yeah, Argus cooldown, once again, doesn't feel very high. It's very spammable. Okay, literally all of my teammates are trolls. <laughs> no, all my teammates are bots, but that's what they are. All right, we want to see how much damage Argus can tank at this point. Probably have to clear out this Fenrir, otherwise I'm going to get a little bit too much pressure before we even get to that point. Mm. All right. No. Oh. Ah! Can't even get the shield off anymore. I was hoping to get the beats and shield there. Well, that's a good note to end. We're not going to wait till the 44 second respawn. And as such, I think this is uh, your job not to die. A solid overview of Hera so far. Probably not my type of guard. We're gonna take a quick look at the uh, Serena screen as well. The defeat screen. And then... That's it. I... I'm really not sure. Like, her combo doesn't seem that strong. Her... Argus seems very squishy at the start. Her abilities have a long delay. Kind of like... Not that rewarding from my first impression. <laughs> All right. Uh, I would say definitely not broken. Look at the damage here, but what have we done to compare to the bots? Oh, okay, well, the bots are really not representative. Not even the Kukulkan bot did more damage. Mm. Yeah. Like, she could obviously, you know, if she had, like, a ton of utility to make up for it through Argus, I could see it more. But then again, Argus doesn't seem to be a utility-focused uh, character either. He's got a bit of a slow. A lot comes down to if you effectively use her 3 plus Argus in a teamfight, but that's also your only escape and defense mechanic. So, bit rough. Bit rough for Hera is my first impression for now. And with that... Thank you guys very much for watching. I will obviously still be trying her out in more games and different roles and all that stuff, but that's the first look. If you're new to the channel, feel free to click the sub button and maybe the bell. It really helps me out. Other than that, see you for the next one tomorrow. Duke Sloth, out.